breaking news. I'm sure some people have seen this. Tucker Carlson and uh, Fox News have parted ways. So Tucker Carlson was sitting here two weeks ago interviewing you. He's gone. What do you make of that? Well, I'm shocked. I'm surprised. Uh, he's a very good person and a very good man and very talented, as you know, and he had very high ratings. So uh, we're just learning about it almost as we speak. This move today by Fox News certainly shows their hand. And I'm also so sure that my former colleague now shares the view that Fox has moved further and further away from the plot. Fox News is moving mainstream. CNN light. With this, I don't know why anybody needs to watch anything on the Murdoch Empire because Tucker was the mainstay of the uh, the populist voice over at uh, Fox. And it's just, this is blockbuster news. What's up, everybody? Major retired Richard Ojeda here. And Tucker Carlson becomes the first TV host to win the Triple Crown, fired from CNN, MSNBC, and Fox. The breaking news Monday morning on every news channel in the country was the apparent firing of Fox host Tucker Carlson. This development comes just days after Fox settled their defamation lawsuit with Dominion Voting Systems for $787 million. This is beyond significant. This is going to change conservative media. Maybe Maybe for the better, maybe for the worst, maybe right down the middle, but it will change. Things will not remain the same. This is abrupt. This is sudden. This is unexpected. And you better believe it is significant, not just for media, but for the entire civilization. Well, he he got fired uh, from all, by all accounts, and uh, I think it caught him by surprise. He wasn't expecting it. I believe, according to the reporting, that they were in the midst of a contract negotiation and he got blindsided by them. Tucker Carlson became the face of Donald Trump's stolen election claims and knowingly reported misinformation to the American public, leading countless people to act on Fox's false claims with violence. The hatred and division that Fox News put out was not only false, it was considered liable. Fox had the choice to pay out or air Rupert Murdoch's dirty laundry in public. So Fox had 787 million reasons to terminate Tucker. Which I've said, hey, the reason to watch Fox, you got Maria in the morning, you've got, uh, you've got Jesse, right? He's getting there, but Tucker's really the reason to, to watch Fox. Uh, with this, I don't know why anybody needs to watch anything on the Murdoch empire because Tucker was the mainstay of the uh, the populist voice over at uh, Fox. And it's just, this is blockbuster news. Slimy Steve Bannon weighed in on Fox News' apparent firing of Tucker Carlson, too. Bannon sounded like he was telling his followers to boycott the Murdoch empire. A little too late, don't you think? You Jabba the hut looking red-nosed hemorrhoid. With Tucker being sidelined, the moldy Bannon now has the top-rated extremist talk show on daytime trash TV. Other networks put their two cents in as well. I think Tucker's been uh, terrific. He's been, especially over the last year or so, he's been terrific to me. There's a lot of turmoil over there, Fox. I mean, 787 yeah. they just paid. Why would they get rid of a guy who's performing? Why would somebody do that to their business? Because they're, they're losing money right now. Their stock has gone down. Newsmax CEO Chris Ruddy released a statement poking fun at Fox. He said that Fox News has been moving to become establishment media, and Tucker Carlson's removal is big progress in that effort. Steve Bannon looks like the worm at the bottom of a tequila bottle that tried to crawl out but fell back in. He is absolutely disgusting and his opinion stinks. Bannon is just trying to be relevant, but in reality he is just another conspiracy crackpot with his nasty head buried up Donald Trump's backside. The good news is that Tucker Carlson's nauseating voice won't be on Fox anymore, but the bad news is that he will likely pop up somewhere else like a surprise case of diarrhea. Tucker will take a double flush to get rid of, and that's a fact. Sappers clear the way, airborne all the way.